Well, what's going on this afternoon, everybody? Hope everybody's having a good day. I'm having a wonderful day. I'm in the ranch truck. And uh, we're headed over to the Harley dealership. Just dropped Miss Linda off at Enterprise Rent a Car, and we are renting a car for tomorrow to take a little trip. Keep an eye out for those videos when you get a chance. If you're not subscribed, I believe I would appreciate it. Blah 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 blah. <laughs> I would appreciate it if you would hit the subscribe button and the bell notification for all for when I upload new content. So, man, there's a lot of there's It's Friday, y'all. It's Freaky Friday. A lot of people drive a little freaky, you know? Not too bad yet. So, we're going to get on over here and... Uh, We'll show you what we're doing. Now, I was just looking at my fuel gauge. Oop, there's a band aid buggy. Wonder which way they're going. Looks like they're going straight. Everybody just keeps blowing through the stoplight, you know? That Band-Aid buggy could have been turning in front of us and everybody's blowing the stoplight, you know? Nobody's, nobody's stopping. Oh. Well, here comes another emergency vehicle. Must be a, uh, must be an accident or something somewhere. But yeah, uh, I'm probably going to have to stop on the way back and get some dino dinosaur juice. Well, everybody, if you've guessed it by now, if you look through that little window back there, I've got my little trailer on, and we got us a wild hog in the back of the, in the trailer. So... Uh, I didn't do any videoing up there at the dealership because they're having a great big barbecue competition right now. It's, I guess it's over Saturday evening, maybe, I don't know. But the Kansas City Airport has a barbecue joint up there. And it's a competition to where the winner has their specialty recipe featured at that barbecue restaurant at the uh, KCI airport so I didn't even know that had that going on I was pulling in I was like what in the world's going on here I thought it was a bike show but it's a barbecue man you could smell it I mean it smelled good so oh a little bumpy uh, we'll get on home here and uh, get this hog unloaded I got a couple more things I need to do to it and uh, so yeah, we'll see you back here in a little bit. Well, everybody, as you can see, we made it back safely. And uh, I'm not real happy with my ranch hand because he left the shop in a mess. I mean, look at this. I mean, come on. He didn't take the he didn't take the lawnmower and he didn't mow the grass. So he's missing now. Uh, let's go out here for a second. Miss Linda. Did you happen to see the ranch hand when you got home? Was he here? No. No? Did you take him anywhere? Did did he ask you for a ride anywhere? I got him donuts. 
You got him donuts? Yeah. Really? Yeah, and I got him a new pair of glasses too. They oh my like, gosh. They actually look like the Tom Cruise ones. I couldn't find any around You didn't one. get me the Tom Cruise glasses that make me look cool? They're Yellowstone ones actually. Huh? They're rip ones. They're Yellowstone. Oh. Well, I get, I get the, I get the ones, those, you know, because I'm going to put my foot in his, you know what. Okay. So, well. Miss Linda's out here cleaning the grill because she's going to do well, a... he's supposed to do it. He was supposed to do it, yeah. No supper for him. No, no supper for, for the, for the ranch hand Benny, right? So, we're going to get the bike unloaded. I guess I'm going to have to sweep everything up. And uh, she's going to make a, uh, she got, she got a, uh, she got me a cauliflower crust pizza. And uh, she's cleaning this grill. I guess we need to tell Benny to put the darn thing in the barn when he gets done with it. Uh, so let's get the bike unloaded. Let's get stuff cleaned up a little bit first. Oh. I know what that's from. That's from the peanut butter and jelly sandwich I left in there over back in December. She is. Oh, yeah. Well, there she is, guys. Uh, I've got to order new <clears throat> grip covers. I got to take those off anyway because it's summertime. I always put those on in the fall and use them all winter long. And uh, uh, one change I wanted to tell, show you guys was we changed out the bars. If you notice, they're a little taller than stock. And don't quote me on this. I think stock are around 10. And uh, we put a, a set of bars on it that are two inches taller. 
So I guess they're probably 14s. If I had a tape measure, I could measure them, but I've, I know I've got a tape measure around here somewhere. But I have the next best thing is I have, I, this is a square. So uh, we're gonna measure, yeah. Those are 14s. The good thing about those is um, they didn't have to change the uh, ca the cables and the wiring and that. They all they had to do was change. Uh, I think in a, pl a plug extension for the for the plugs, the controls on each side. So there's one more thing I got to do, and. Uh, I'm pretty excited for it. Okay, well, two things. Uh, if y'all been following my channel for very long, I had uh, my channel decal right here on the uh, side of the trunk on the both sides. And since they had to replace it, I had to order new decals. So I've got to put those on. But I'm not going to do that tonight because I got to unfold it and lay it flat. I'm going to let it lay flat for quite a while with a uh, two by four or something on them. Uh, but another thing I'll show you real quick is I got a new full face Bluetooth modular helmet. And uh, oh gosh. For those of you that do know, I did not have my helmet on when I had uh, my accident back in April, April 14th when I laid the bike over right here in front of the house. So I will uh, show you that here real quick, just a minute, if I can get this thing adjusted right. Uh, there we go. Let's see if it'll stand up. There! Ta-da! And let's see here. Where's the opening at? There it is. It comes in a bag. It comes in a custom Harley Davidson bag. All right, before my battery died, I don't know how far we got, but I'm un taking the the new helmet out of the bag here and showing you the new, the new helmet. Now, this is what you call a modular helmet. And it has, it has Bluetooth in it. So it has speakers on each side for your, that right there by your ears. And this is what you call a modular helmet. It has a visor on the inside that flips down. You can flip it right back up there and that's how it flips down is right here on the side. Also, you push this button over here like that and it, and it flips up. <laughs> there, just like that when you're wearing it. Uh, this is actually a medium and they didn't have a large, but the medium felt snug and the padding will add, conform to your, to my head eventually. So yeah. Now the bike is gloss black. I got matte black. It's no big deal. I like the matte black because, uh, you know, you don't have to polish it. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway that's my new helmet and uh, I'm very very happy that I got it and I'm sure a lot of y'all are happy leave me a comment down below uh, and uh, give the video a thumbs up for me I'm just I'm just ecstatic 
thrilled that I've got the bike home and uh, probably Sunday morning I'm thinking about taking her out and going for a little ride and uh, uh, just kind of take it easy you know so like I said give the video a thumbs up for me I appreciate every each and every one of you that have watched all my videos and uh, hopefully we can put a smile on your face make you laugh a little bit once in a while and uh, kind of forget all your troubles you know and, and this thing right here that's what that's what it does for me to be out on the open road on a on the motorcycle is leaving the troubles behind so if you're not subscribed, please subscribe. Hit the bell notification for the all. And uh, I appreciate each and every one of you watching, like I said. And uh, we'll see you on down the road sometime. And uh, say hi to a stranger. Thank a veteran by shaking his hand. And we'll talk to you all in the next one. Thanks for watching. Where's those glasses that you got me? Right there. Right there. <laughs> Oh, there they are. For those of you that don't know, I am a great big Yellowstone series fan. And Rip is, Rip is the guy right there. He's the day saver. <laughs> so, Miss Linda got me some Rip glasses. Y'all have a good night. We'll see you on the next one. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. And as I always say, say hi to a stranger. You might make somebody's day.